Yeah, and want to go to a Mardi Gras ball, but you don't own a gown. Well, two women decided that the women and men who serve in the military and their spouses needed a place to turn without the high cost. Meg Ferris shows us how they're fulfilling dreams by saying yes to the dress. Oh, it's so pretty. <laughs> Third row over, they're over there. Beautiful. Look at that. Oh, my word. She is gorgeous. Oh, my oh, I love it. For eight years now, Shar Wenrich and Kathy Callahan have been hard at work. They want to make sure that military wives and women on active duty get a chance to go to Mardi Gras and military balls. Gowns and all the accessories can get pricey and out of reach, so they started Operation Free Ball Gown. It's very humbling knowing that people in New Orleans are so they're so generous enough to go throughout their closets and donate all of these gorgeous gowns to us. Probably need one more rack here. This week, they're sorting the 2200 long and cocktail gowns and dresses, evening shoes, undergarments, and fashion jewelry to be ready for the giveaway on Saturday in the gym on the Naval Air Station Joint Reserve Base in Bell Chase. I ended up uh, scoring myself like a $400 gown. I just got it hand for like 50 bucks, but that was amazing. And that Valentino designer cape dress, that goes for $7,500 to $13,000. And there are more designer dresses, like this Calvin Klein. And as you can see, a lot of them still have the tags on them, brand new, donated by stores. Members of the crew of Iris donated a lot this year, along with other people in stores. They're also donated wedding gowns. This gal, she came out in this wedding gown, and all of us just stopped in awe and, and she just started crying because she knew that that was her dress. Kathy is fighting cancer but still is here with Shar carrying on their brainchild. When the doctors told me um, 20 years ago that I could not have children, I thought, you know, God, there must be a reason. And the reason being that he wanted me to try to be a mother in order to help our families. And she is. From Bell Chase, Meg Farris, Eyewitness News. Dresses. All right, you can still donate dressy clothes and shoes and jewelry for women, men, and children. We have a list of all the donation sites with this story on our website, wwltv.com.